Hamilton's vibrant culture and community are drawing more and more buyers to the area. Judy Marcells from Judy Marcells Real Estate joins us now with how this is affecting the real estate market in the city. What is the current state of the market in Hamilton? Well, interestingly enough, the market is actually quite healthy. And prices, uh, we just got the statistical analysis that came out for July. Prices were actually up marginally, which is a benefit, obviously, to some and maybe not to others. But it does show that the market in Hamilton is still fairly healthy. And I think that's really important to our economic base in Hamilton. And it's also important to all the families out there who are buying or selling or even some of the young people thinking of buying right now. now I don't want to put you on the spot, but <laughs> what is the average price of a home in Hamilton right now? I thought it was like upwards of $800,000. You are correct. In fact, I just got the statistics out right now. It's $847,000 and, eight, uh, pardon me, $847,087. Well, that is a big <laughs> chunk of change. What is drawing people to Hamilton with those prices? Well, interestingly enough, Hamilton is still uh, relatively lower than some of our sister cities, for example, Toronto. And what we're seeing is a lot of young couples moving to Hamilton to benefit from the better pricing so they can buy their first home, uh, enjoy their family, and do those sort of things. What advice do you have for a young couple or even just a young person trying to buy a home, their first home? Well, clearly, I think they have to be very careful and cautious, and they have to plan. They should be saving uh, some money for a down payment. They should take a look at what their um, income streams are, and don't overstretch. Just enjoy. Uh, we're seeing some neighborhoods that are still affordable in Hamilton. You know, take a look at those neighborhoods, and some of them are wonderful, and um, just enjoy. Because what is the average down payment on a home right now in the city if the, if the average cost is eight? Like, that's a lot of money that people have to come up with to get into the housing market. Very true. The interesting part, though, is a lot of the lending institutions right now are helping uh, young people uh, coordinate their income versus their costs. And I think they're taking a look at that. And as opposed to the days when I bought my first house, you know, it was very clear how much you had to have down and all of that. Today, they're being a little more flexible because they want young people to enjoy the market, but not overstretch themselves. I think that's really critical in their decision making. What are you seeing as the, the hottest part of the city right now? Uh, it's interesting you say that because that has two elements. One is a very popular area of the city, of course, is the southwest area, Aberdeen area. The people enjoy that area because of uh, the schools that are in close proximity. You know, the Niagara Escarpment is, is really uh, always an attraction. But we're also seeing a reinterest in some of the northeast section of Hamilton. And it's really wonderful to see because if you look at the history and you look at some of those streets, they're beautiful homes, two and a half story brick homes, but for a long time they weren't attracting people. Now they're seeing, seeing life come back. Because that's where the lower priced homes are that we were talking about earlier. Yes. All right, so yeah. people should be looking at those as an opportunity to uh, even build some equity, obviously. Well, yes, and it's interesting to say about equity because one doesn't really know where the economy is going. Yeah. I would like people to really think about not just building an equity, but also enjoying life in their home to make sure that it's something that really feels comfortable and, and they can live without huge risk and you know worry. Yeah. All right, all great advice. Thank you much, very much, Dr. Marcel. <laughs> More show after the break.